actually I joined the fraternity when I was uh, still in high school, which is a little unusual, but uh, my four older brothers were all members of the fraternity, and uh, that was a big reason why I went there. Um, and it's something that uh, Mike Fanning and I share in common. His two younger brothers joined after he did too, and it's, uh, it's just kind of makes it extra special when your brothers are in with you. So I first met Mike, uh, it has to be my sophomore year. He joined the house a year later than I did, but he's actually a year older than me. Um, we always had kind of a special relationship because we were both social chairmen. And he, even though I was younger than him, he called me his social chairman dad. So social dad was my his little pet name for me, which I loved. And uh, and he just he's he's just a, a magnetic personality that uh, lights up a room and everybody wants to be around. Uh, brings energy to whatever you're doing, um, and you can't not have a good time when you're around when you're around Mike. I think it's great what uh, what Rick Ball, who's part of our group, started here, um, and we got inspired by a, another recent tribute that was made to somebody who was a part of our fraternity. I think that was an inspiration for this, but it made made Rick and all of us think that um, what Mike has meant to us and meant to the fraternity needs to be known for you know for the future because. Um, he joined the house without any experience uh, in that fraternity, and uh, and he just was such a key part of it, and and he stayed such a key part of it. And then he's faced these challenges in his life um, with some health challenges, and uh, I mean, there's just no other word to say other than he's an inspiration to everybody who watches him navigate through that, and always stay positive, always stay determined. When you watch somebody handle things with such courage and grace and determination it can only inspire you to try to be a better person yourself and to and to be that strength for the people around you because when those things are going on it's hard for everybody and uh, and when somebody's experiencing that kind of challenge and they can still be an inspiration for other folks I, I don't know how you can be uh, I don't I don't I don't know how you can be any more you know of a role model for people